Hello all, Project Wargaming here with an update on some of the uh, models that I've been working on. So uh, I've wanted to do uh, some more Napoleonics, and so I'm happy to say that I've been able to get uh, two more sets uh, modeled. So these are uh, infantry and artillery. Um, one is in with helmets, and the other is with tricorn. So those are two of the most, uh, I guess, in-demand uh, hats that uh, guys who are interested in Napoleonic ranges have requested. So was able to get those modeled. Um, each set comes with um, three different styles of uh, infantry, I guess. Uh, so uh, marching or firing here with some skirmishers out front. And then uh, these guys are charging and then these guys are marching with their uh, arms shouldered. And then... Um, Artillery comes with uh, like four different uh, types of artillery and then a caisson and a wagon and then also each uh, set has like a square if you want to use that. Um, great little markers if you're uh, using the rules of blue troop. So um, same thing over here with the helmets. They have the same marching, charging, and firing units, um, square, and the artillery setup. So i um, very happy with how they came out. It took me a little while to, <laughs> to figure, to remember how to, to do it all, um, but uh, happy with the results. So they are up on my website. Uh, you can purchase them if you're interested. I hope to get, uh, I want to do infantry and artillery with uh, Mutz on, the, that uh, Prussian hat. And then um, I think I want to try to do uh, infantry and great coats with Shakos. And that will probably be uh, it for for uh the napoleonic range for quite some time so that gets it most in i'll, I'll probably i, I want to do like uh cavalry and mutzes too so some of the uh, uh prussian um cavalry so that's it we'll talk to you later